throughout this entire season and they have helped us elevate, okay? It's giving bigger and better. Shout out to Walmart. Now, we are currently tied. This episode will determine who is the overall winner this time around. Everyone knows I took Mad L's season one and everyone knows it's my time to win. It is. Ooh. It really is your time to win. I need this. <laughs> welcome to the Tea and Coco Walmart scavenger hunt. My name is Roxy and I'll be your host today. Let's welcome our players. Tea, Coco. Hi. Hi. Thank you. I'm very official. Oh, you are. I like the best. You have so many jobs. <laughs> yeah. Listen. This one's temporary. It's Los though. Angeles. You gotta come back to work on Monday. Yeah, 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 yeah. 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 Anyway, <laughs> today doing? you both will be tested on your knowledge of grocery store products in this store. The two of you will go head to head in an intense competition to see who reigns supreme in the world of Walmart. Are you ready? All I heard was the word competition, and you know, Coco. You know. Yeah, 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 yeah. I will have to dominate. That's all that I can do. <laughs> <laughs> well, let's see. It who... depends on the challenge. Yeah, exactly. Let's let's see. Let's see. I'm a who... Walmart customer. Are you? What? Okay. I'm always smiling. There is a display of items that can be found in this store. The goal is to get as close to the number that is printed on this card. Terrell, uh -huh. you don't even go grocery shopping like that. So I'm on red. You don't go grocery shopping. Yes, I do. For what? Groceries. You post me. You didn't cook. That's not true all the time. It's true most of the time. But more of the time, seven. I'm grocery shopping than the times that you are. Was but the I'm the math you? person, though. Huh? Oh, what about that? Okay, what well, about that? What about that? You know well, numbers about productions, but about produce? Ooh! You're not wrong not. about that. You're not wrong I'll about that. Not. You're not wrong about that. Come on, what the first product is? The first product is a staple of the South. Some like it's sweet. Some like it's savory. The first product is grits. Grits! It's team salt all the all way. Day. Okay. What's that butter, butter in there? Ooh. Mantequi, yeah. Come on, Lord. <laughs> hey, amen. <laughs> ah! <laughs> this is Are actually... your answers locked in? Yes. yes. Please reveal your answers. Okay. Those have been locked in. We will reveal. Why do we both price. have point forty nine? That's Get out of my head! Oh, that's bonkers. That's crazy. Yeah, now. are you guys standing too close to each other? Can you I see? I didn't see nothing thing. of him. I was hiding my thing. I didn't want him to see mine because I'm correct. Well, we will have our judges lock in these numbers, and I will reveal the prices at the end of the round to see who wins. Since its induction in 1942, it has become one of the most popular pickle brands in the United States. Mm. Right Please down? write down. How much you think this 80 ounce jar of Laskic pickle jar is? Oh, okay. That's some big ones. Mmm, that's the whole pickle. Mm. They're cucumbers that like passed away. Oh, I can't. Oh, please. Pickles are just rotten, old, tired cucumbers. And you think for a second, I don't know that. Answers locked. Yes, yes. ma'am. Please reveal them to our judges. Ooh. Ooh. Oh. Oh. Wow. Get away from my brain. Wow. That's crazy. 
I'm in there like a stain. For I real. mean, seriously, like, freak yourself. Buried in that brain. Y'all are some freaky, freaky. People. I really, really. It's, I, no, I'm it's uncanny. Nervous. Beware. Once you start popping these into your mouth, you won't be able to quit. So your next item to price is Oots 28 ounce cheese balls. Hey. Ooh, hey man. Cheese balls. Low key, I love Cheeto balls. Low key. I don't even know if they're. Be passionate about them Cheeto balls, okay. sir. Hi, key, I love Cheeto balls. <laughs> <laughs> I like Cheeto Balls because in the office, when they went to that new office space, because he started the Michael Scott paper company, and then they were bored because they didn't have no clients, what they would do to entertain themselves and lift their spirits was try to guess all them Cheeto Balls, and then Pam got all them Cheeto Balls at the end. You know, yeah, you're right. Because mm -hmm. Ryan started the fire. It was always burning till the time was turning. Ryan started the fire. Please reveal your answers. I don't know why I chose this number. That's... It just spoke to me. I don't think anything is priced this number. <laughs> <laughs> you can bake them, fry them, or boil them. Mm. It is eaten in more states than Idaho. This product is a five pound bag of potatoes. A potato flew around my room before you came. Excuse the mess it made. It usually doesn't rain it. In all my life. I ain't never bought no bag of potatoes. Never in my life. You ain't never want to make no mashed potatoes from scratch? I did, but I always buy just the amount that I need. I never bought a bag oh, of potatoes. Oh, you're right. It's like, what are you going to do with all those potatoes? A mm. bag of potatoes? Those are definitely going bad in my house. Actually, and you hate when they like start sprouting. Woo! That's really gross, man. <laughs> ah! Really nasty. I don't know. This was hard. I'd actually have no idea. Where did these taters come from? Did they come from the Idaho? Was it straight from the source? What? Uh huh. It says premium potatoes. Pre oh, it's premium. Is it organic? Please reveal your answers. Ooh. Okay. I feel like I've been on the high side for many of these. I hope somebody's keeping track. <laughs> Are you keeping when track? when I take this W, <laughs> and you take this L back. <laughs> I'm honestly, my confidence is on the floor. Low, 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 low. Because honestly, I don't know about any of these things. Terrell only purchases camera equipment. <laughs> Truly. Because we really? were at a tech store, um, <laughs> out of gas. Yeah. Running on it. I will have you dead to rights. It's red, juicy, and sweet. So apple. The apple. This product can go on just about anything. Oh. Uh -oh. Our next product is... A 32 ounce of Heinz ketchup! <sighs> I know the price of this. Your soul! Ketchup. You sickening, <laughs> sickening scoundrel. You're disgusting. You're lower than dirt to me. I feel abhorrence for you. Ketchup. What about mustard? Mustard's good. I love honey mustard. I'm screaming. I don't know what you got against tomato ketchup, but it is deeply rooted in your spirit. I can't even look <laughs> at her ugly face. It's how many ounces? 32. Mm. How much do you charge for a gallon of sadness? <laughs> as high as you can price it. <laughs> Damn. We are really far apart. Wow. I can't wait to see these results, because that's all I know. This man ain't went grocery shopping in a hot, it's been a Decade. long time. Terrell said $1.99. Coco's price was $5.99. True price, $4.78. Let's go! You went over, B. You, you can't go, go over. over. Wait, you can't. Let's go. I was closer to it. But oh, oh, we oh, both whack. went over. That's oh, whack. We both went over. I'm not oh, dancing with you. I'm not dancing. Over. I'm not dancing. Oh, I'm not dancing. I'm not dancing. I'm not dancing. I'm hating it. I'm hating it. You, you know what? I knew over. you weren't going to be for me. Jerk. Well, of course, the ketchup one I was gonna get right. You don't even look at the ketchup in the grocery store. How could you know? How could you know how much Actually, that ketchup Actually, that's not costs? true. I stare at it and I try to make it disappear. For our five pound bag of potatoes, Terrell said $6.49, Coco said $4.99. True price, $3.47. That was hey! Coco. Hey, 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 hey,
It is. Three forty seven for all y'all better come on shop at your local Walmart. <laughs> That's nothing okay. for them potatoes. We are dead so far. Uh, 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 uh. Potato, 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 potato. Cheese balls. Mm. Terrell said eight oh nine. Coco's price nine ninety. That's a lot of balls. Dang. True price. Seven twenty-eight. Talk Dang. to me nice in these streets. Dang. Upsetting. Talk to me nice in these streets. Upsetting. Uh, you already know. I told you I keep a bucket on hand. The girl's only off by a little dime or so. I'm a dime and it's a shame. I knew what it was worth. Upsetting. Uh, they, they all need one more. All right. All I need is one more. How about you put your tally? How about you put your oh, tally? Yeah. Thank y'all. All I need is one more. Okay. Dang it. All I need is one more. Are you ready? Terrell said 710. Coco said 699. True price? Oh! 624! Hey, yeah! Oh my God, bro. I guess I misjudged you by your veiny, gross character. Uh huh, say sorry. I mean, I'm apologetic at best, but I'm not sorry, ho. But thank you. I do accept the point, Pickles, you know. So we are bro. fighting to the death. Bro, bro, wait, chill out. Are you kidding? Woo! Cause I love shopping for groceries every once in a while. Let's go, rocks. Go on ahead and read that one, babe. Goddamn fly. <laughs> that almost went in your mouth. So Terrell said 349. Coco said 249. It was only off by a dollar. True price? 328. I don't understand. I think that makes me win. Oh Does my that make God. me win? Oh! <laughs> Damn it! Are you kidding? Oh, don't switch up now. <laughs> don't switch up now. Just take your L and be out. Oh close. my God. I am so upset. I am so upset. You guys are I great. am so, I am so upset. I feel like I can't move from this pose. <laughs> I have to revel in this moment for as long as I can. Thank you so much, Rocky. <laughs> Thank you so much, Walmart. Thank you so much, me. <laughs> round two, I'm coming for the jugular, okay? Because round one, it was very close, Coco, so don't get too comfortable. I would never. That's how you lose. I'm you get comfortable. I'm very upset. All right, we're back for round two. Round one was intense. We are going to have Terrell go head to head with Coco once again. The goal is to read each clue, uh -huh. run back into the store, bring the product back into your basket. Uh -huh. The first person to do it the fastest and bring all four products back correctly uh -huh. wins this round. All right. I'm gonna read you off your first clue. Okay. This is a cereal that is amazing. It's a healthy breakfast with two scoops of, and? That's it, that's it? Go. Oh. Ah! Slipper shoes, slipper shoes. Duh, it's Raisin Bran. Who does not know about the two scoops of raisins? You ain't know about the two scoops of raisins. You know I don't know anything that has to do with raisins because I don't like raisins. Honestly, not a, no, I do like raisins. My favorite cookie is oatmeal raisin. He be like, try this dessert. And I'm like, no, because you have the taste palate of a 90 year old grandmother. Oh, where is it, where is it, where is it? Where is it? Boom, 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 boom. Got it, got it, got it, got it. Okay, this is really hard. Oh, 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 oh. <sighs> yes, okay. If you've got a yes, bit of a correct. sweet tooth, look for the red spoon. Some like vanilla, some even strawberry, but chocolate really stings my tooth. Got it, got it, got it, got it. Betty Crocker, Betty Crocker. Boy, thank God for grandma. Cause if it hadn't been for her, I would have no idea who Betty Crocker was. But I know her very well. My grandma can't make. But she know how to add an egg and some water. Oh my God! This childhood meal served ring like pasta. A little less messy than the real thing. A bit quicker and a bit faster. I know it. I know it. It's SpaghettiOs. Right here, spaghetti and pasta. SpaghettiOs. Okay. Holy crap. John Travolta starred in the movie Grease and the movie about disco. His hair was so shiny, you would think he would use Crisco. Now, come on, y'all. I'm from the South. Who 
What? I've never been inside of a home in this cell that didn't have buckets of Crisco. Buckets of it. Nobody said it was a good thing, but right now in this moment, it is very helpful to sealing my victory in round two. Crisco. Crisco. Okay, in the car, time. Okay. Holy Hannah with a Way side to go. Of Poor cameraman. I am down. so proud of You're you. You're next. <laughs> you ready to jog? That was easy. Come on, challenge me here. I brought back four for four. Correct, 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 correct. It's five. Are they all That's right? Five. Are they all correct? They are all judges? Correct, yes. Coco, are you ready for your clues? Those were basically parables, but yes, I'm ready for those. I have total faith in you. Okay, your first clue. This tangy beverage gives Kel Mitchell a rush. If it's not Sunkiss, then it has to be. Crush. Yes! Okay! Yeah. Okay, sports drinks. Juice. Is that where this is? Crush? 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 Can I find some crush? Is crush a juice? Is crush a juice? Um, crush? I feel like there was some saboteur going on up in this Walmart because I've drank in me a fair share of orange crush sodas. Why couldn't I find it? I started to think maybe it's been turned into a juice and now it's in the juice aisle. I'm not sure. Where's crush? I don't know. Crush, is that a juice? Help me! Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. Where's soda? Where's soda? Where the hell is soda? I don't know. Oh, so, okay, 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 okay. Oh my God, oh my God. Crush, 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 crush. Oh my God. I'm embarrassed at my own self. Be serious, be all the way serious. Y'all had to rail, not Siri turning on, not you girl. <laughs> oh. They had Terrell carrying Raisin Brand, a little can of soda. You want me to sprint with 12 cans of Orange Crush? Who says you had to sprint with 12 cans? You know you have to bring it back to the beginning of the thing so Rossi can Why see it. Why did you it. get one? I'm supposed to open up the can of soda in the Walmart? No! Why did you get one two liter? I didn't think of that. <laughs> <gasps> That's unfair. Amazing, okay, here you go. Marlon and Sean. <laughs> Marlon, Sean, nickname, their father. This on the WB hit show, The Wayans Brothers. We call it cereal. What Marlon, nickname? Sean, nickname their father. This on The Wayans Brothers hit show, The Wayans Brothers. We call it cereal. I watched SpongeBob <laughs> and then I watched Hannah Montana. <laughs> we call it. You can what? ignore the war Wayans Brothers and you still get it. What do you nickname your pop, your father? <laughs> Popcorn. Okay. Pop. Pop. Cereal. Pop and cereal. Um. Pop and cereal. Pop. 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 Pops. 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 I just want to make a note that you do not need to have watched the show to use context clues to find a cereal that could also be the name of somebody's daddy. I ate one cereal my entire life. Reese's. Oh, God. Yes. You didn't eat Fruit Loops? No. I ate too many. It's not a rumor or the town scuttlebutt. It's a well-known fact the sweetest gourd is what is a gourd? Come on now, Be, you, you guys. Who does know what a gourd is? Who doesn't know what a gourd is? I don't know. America? <laughs> it's not a rumor or the town scuttle, but it's a well-known fact. The sweetest gourd is. I don't know what a gourd. What is what a gourd is? I mean, I, 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 when would I have eaten a gourd? <laughs> ah! What? Okay, no. You guys, I'm not even doing this with y'all because you know you're hearing me read these clues out looking confunkled. <laughs> pass, 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 pass. I'll think about the gourd as I ran around. It's a fruit, seed, and a nut. It's a fruit, seed, and a nut. Most famously known for its tropical flower. But what 
you're looking for is for baking, specifically more flour. It's a fruit, seed, and a nut. It tells you where to go. Oh. What, you're looking, what you're looking for is for baking. Yes. More specifically, flour. flour. It's a fruit, seed, and a nut. I don't even. It's a fruit, seed, and a nut. Wait, it's a fruit? A vegetable is not a fruit. Olive? No. But what you're looking for is for baking, more specifically flour. What the hell does that mean? If I don't know the precedents, <laughs> if I know five out of 40, you think I'm gonna automatically assume we're talking coconuts when we're talking fruit? <laughs> <laughs> I just got a lot. And the gourd. It's not a rumor on the town. Scatterbutt. It's a well known fact the sweetest gourd is a what the okay. I'll tell you what a gourd is. Okay, a gourd What's is a gourd? It's squash or a squash. Or like a pumpkin. pumpkin. Yes. A gourd is like, it's a produce. So what is a scuttlebutt? <laughs> and it was. It's not, it's not important. It rhymes. It's a well-known fact that the sweetest gourd. If a gourd is, is a squash, now it's rhyme sweet. it. It's not a rumor or the town scuttlebutt. It's a well-known fact that the sweetest gourd is what kind of squash? Come with me. <laughs> so Coco is having quite a difficult time trying to find the scuttlebutt clue, so I'm gonna help her out. Squash! Cause you got me out here and you're looking for squash. Ah, yeah, yeah, no. What is this? Come on. What is that? Come with me, come with me. I just ran around for nothing. Yeah. Because you actually had, all had, the had it easy. easy. Clues. No. You had it easy. You didn't even have you to run. You had it easy. You didn't even have to run for the last one. Put that in the cart. It's called a butternut squash. Okay. What was my, what was my time? When in Hades, was a coconut a fruit? It's definitely a fruit. I'm realizing that now. Ah. The, yep. Put I'd love for anyone who's ever eaten a butternut squash or ever has said scuttlebutt to say that in the comments. I'm looking for you personally. Was. Ew. Four minutes and 18 seconds. The champ is here. The champ is here. So that does in fact make Terrell the winner of round two. I really took care of that round. That was giving KO one punch. Wow. Knockout. It's very much like the the hockey round where you got like 17 pucks in and I got two. Yeah. One deserves another. Heck, had to get you back. A little bit of pain. I mean, back. we are yin and yang, so yeah. I'm not even surprised that when it comes to the brain, yes. When it comes to ice skating or anything sporty, besides tennis, we still need to see who would eat at tennis. Congratulations. Ooh. This is the final round of the final episode of Tea and Coco season two. I mean, it literally all comes down to this. Literally. Put your battle on on, sis. Give me a helmet now. <sighs> there is no, you know what, Never mind. Here are the rules. I am going to give you your first clue. From this clue, it will take you to your first product. From each product there that you find correctly, it will take you to your next clue. So you must solve that clue to know where to go next. All right, are you ready for your first clue? Yes. McCormick yelled, Eureka, I found my spicy friend. He is red and named... Hot sauce. Eureka, I'm tired of playing these effing games. Cause all these riddles are effing lame. I don't know this shit. I don't know that name. How about that riddle? I'm just gonna go towards seasoning. Okay, great, good luck. You can do this. McCormick, spicy friend. McCormick, McCormick, spicy friend. McCormick, spicy, spicy. McCormick, Eureka, I found my spicy friend. His name is Red. He is Red. He is Red. His name is, oh my God, I feel crazy. McCormick, please. If you are McCormick, please shout yourself out. His name, Hot Taco. I'm gonna take all of these. Eureka, I found my spicy friend, and his name is Hot Sauce. 
He's spicy though, that's fact. <laughs> All right, no, these don't make any sense. Spicy, spicy, spicy. I'm just gonna say this. I don't understand anything else, that's, that's all I'm doing. Wait, there's no clue here, so that can't be right. Roxy. Okay, I don't understand this because McCormick makes taco seasoning. It's riddles, okay? Eureka, oh, what rhymes with Eureka? Excuse me, ma'am, I'm so apologetic. Eureka, pepper, oh my God, it's right there. What the hell? Oh my God. Okay, when you need a good sandwich, eat it when it's fresh. Put one on top and one on the bottom, and you fill in the rest. Bread, this is bread? Oh! It's filled with macadamia nuts and a name for a famous lake. Take a bite and get your life. These treats are deliciously baked. Come on, man, macadamia nuts named for a famous lake. Treats, let's go towards cookies and crackers. Treats, macadamia nuts, macadamia nuts. It's filled with macadamia nuts. So first of all, let's find any treat that's filled with macadamia nuts. None. And named for a famous lake. Named for a famous lake. Take a bite and get your life. These treats are deliciously baked. I don't even, I literally don't even know what that means. Oh, Roxy, damn. This is so annoying. Okay, now this is quite embarrassing. The cameraman petty as hell for <coughs> sitting there on the envelope while I look around giving deer in headlights. Like ta Yeah. You're not serious. Take a bite and get your life. These treats are delicious and baked. Lake Tahoe. Macadamia nuts. Yes. I don't know. It's Does sweet. it rhyme with Lake Tahoe? It's called that. It's not called Lake Tahoe, it's just called Tahoe. The cookie is called Tahoe? Yes. The cookie is called Tahoe. Okay. Oh, it's here somewhere. Tahoe? Tahoe. Is there a cookie named Tahoe? Searching for you. Where, ho? Where are you at? Tahoe? These clues are ridiculous. Where's the Tahoe cookie? I don't know how I didn't see that bright yellow on that <laughs> white packaging, and that is what gets me. Uh, couldn't have been more in your face, babe. Couldn't have been more in my face. I'm, oh. Damn! Her name is synonymous with breakfast. Her body shaped like whoa. If you're into morning flap, flapjacks, you'll already know. Miss Buttermilk, she thick as hell. Miss Buttermilk, Miss Buttermilk, Miss Buttermilk, Miss Buttermilk, Miss Buttermilk, Miss Buttermilk. Buttermilk. Please tell me, y'all, you would think this brand name, you think this brand's name would lend itself to making honey, but instead it produces an under the sea treat that won't cost you a lot of money. Huh? Oh, you think? No, wait. Lend itself to making honey? Oh my God, I can't live my life. You would think this brand. Okay, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. Ramen and dry. Ramen and... won't cost you money. Where is the freaking fish? Something here, something. No, this is chili. This is spam won't cost you money. Under the sea, these are all cheap. I have no word for myself except, I'm sorry, <laughs> that you had to sit there and feast your eyes on your own disaster. But this is my life. All those clues did not make sense and did you see me give up? Because I'm crazy. Even if I don't know what's happening, it must keep happening. Guys, ah! it's healthiest to eat these vitamin-rich plants raw, but if you're feeling snacky, you can enjoy them through a straw. You can enjoy them through a straw. Vegetable juice. Vegetable juice? Vegetable juice. Vegetable juice? V8? No, that's not right. Where? No, this isn't right. Are we talking about veggie straws? Hold on. Where the hell are the veggie straws? That can't be right. Wait, what the hell? Oh my God. We are talking about veggie straws. 
I have eaten a veggie straw when I'm trying to be healthy, but I still crave salt. And maybe, you know, maybe my thing is I should expand my food palette. Cause I'm up in this Walmart. Ah, ah time, amazing. We have champagne. We will find out after Terrell goes if you get to pop it. All right, Terrell, yes. final round. You must mm -hmm. be Coco. That is the only goal that you have. I'm going to read you this final clue. And from uh -huh. here, each clue will lead you to the grand prize. Mm -hmm. McCormick yelled, Eureka, I found yeah. my spicy friend. He is red and named? Africa. Yes. Oh my God, can't even drive. Go, 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 go! Boom, I hear the word McCormick. I'm already knowing it's a spice, okay? Easy. And then Eureka, spicy, paprika. You know, you call it food color. You don't even give nothing, no taste, but it's, it's like, it makes things darker. Like your mac and cheese and stuff, you know, we make mac and cheese together. Paprika makes things, it makes things darker when you bake it. So why would you bring up the mac and cheese? Did you lose that too? <laughs> Jeez, going down. Ah, perfect, okay. When you need a good sandwich, eat it when it's fresh, put one on top and, and one under, and you feel it. When you need a good sandwich, eat it when it's fresh, put one on top, and one under, and you can film the rest. You need a good sandwich. You need a good sandwich, eat it when it's fresh. Sandwich, one on top, one on, oh bread. One, uh, ah, got it. It's filled with macadamia nuts and named for a famous lake. Oh, that's a that cookie, that's a cookie, that's a cookie. Tao, tao, tao. Take a bite and get your life. These treats are deliciously baked. Tao, cookies, my mom loves those. Wrong way, taco. Yes, my mom loves these. Yes. Yes. Shout out to my mom. Her name is synonymous with breakfast. I can't read. If you're into morning flapjacks, you are you already know, Mrs. Butterworth. Where the hell do you find syrup? As previously stated, not a fan of pancakes and waffles. This one was a good clue. This was a very I quite, good. I quite yeah. accepted this clue as yeah. a clue. The rest were, were essays that I didn't study for. <laughs> <laughs> oh, the pressure, the pressure. You would think, you would think this brand name would lend itself to making honey, but instead it produces a delicious treat from under the sea and it won't cost you a lot of money. What the? You would think this brand will lend itself to making honey, but instead it produces a delicious treat from under the sea. I don't get it. Now this one's a doozy. What is that? You would think this brand will lend itself to making honey. Bees, 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 okay. What's a bee brand? Under the sea, seafood. But the name will lend itself to making honey, but instead it produces a delicious treat from under the sea. It won't cost you a lot of money. Where is seafood? Okay, where's the... Okay, seafood, seafood, seafood. Okay, canned seafood. Oh, I don't even know why it's here, but I found it. Oh, bumblebee! It's healthiest to eat these vitamin-rich plants raw, but if you're feeling snacky, you can also enjoy them through a straw. But I don't know what that means. Straws, plastic? No, it's a grocery. It's healthiest to eat these vitamin-rich plants raw, but if you're feeling snacky, you can also enjoy them through a straw. Okay, let's go. Oh, no! Nobody caught that. Oh, f Vegetable straws. Vegetable. Veggie straws. Veggie straws, that's a chip. That's a chip. Veggie straws is a chip. Veggie straws is a chip. Veggie straws. Veggie straws. Veggie straws, veggie straws. Show yourself, show yourself. Show yourself. Ah! Wait, are they not chips? Oh, I think I'm in the wrong aisle. Veggie straws, veggie straws, veggie straws. Where's all the healthy snacks? Oh my God, where are these things? Where are they? Veggie straws, veggie straws, veggie straws, veggie straws. Veggie straws. Go, go. I didn't pop it. Oh! oh. Don't but know how that it. happened. The time. Did I get it? Did I get it? Did I get it? Six minutes, 14 seconds. Terrell, you are the winner of Walmart Scavenger Hunt. Let's 
go once again. It's me. It's me, oh Lord. You don't need to yell your victory screams. I can hear them from here and I can hear them in my nightmares, okay? Thank you. Ah! I cannot believe Man. another season has went by and Court herself is taking a big old L. And this is how a villain was born. <laughs> I'm the headline, okay? You gotta get on my calendar. Period. Uh, uh, yeah. That's good. Thank you. That helped a little. <laughs> helped a little. How about you go scavenger hunt a water? You're giving dehydration. What? Oh. Let's also the water keep on. in mind, that was only four minutes away from my time. Yeah, that was pretty hard. Thank you. I couldn't find the veggie straws. I don't, I've never bought them. I went to veggie juice. Cause I'm the champ! <laughs> That's the sound of champions. I have a new bunion now, and I think I'll go to the, the health department and get that wrapped up. They have hurts. everything you need. They have everything. They have everything you need at a low, low price. God. Yeah, get her soaking, because she lost. Get her some more. Don't look at me. Get the loser. 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 <laughs> what a ride. What a ride. And they were highs, literal highs. And oh, were there lows? There were literally lows. There were stinks. Mm, there were there scares. Were colds, okay? There were colds. There were all types of feelings in this body. There was, I, there was heat on my ass. There was heat on your ass. And cups on your back. And needles in my skin. Damn, we did a lot. One thing about us, we're yeah. gonna have a time. We're it doesn't matter what time. we're doing. It's gonna be funny and it's gonna be fearful. Yeah. It's gonna be unforgettable. You know, it wasn't that fearful last season. No. This season had an extra level of torture yeah. mm -hmm. that, mm -hmm. uh, just compare the haunted houses. I mm -hmm. mean, what? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. We'll I would go back and grab that squid any day now yeah. just to not have to do <laughs> half of the things I did this season. <laughs> hindsight, man, hindsight. Man. Hindsight. The moral of the story of this season is go out, try new things. Yes. You know? Be fearless. Be fearless. Try and things. have fun with the time that you have on this side of mm. heaven. You never know when that clock is gonna run out. Have a blast. Yeah. With your bestie. With your bestie. Tea and Koga. Yeah, tea and Koga. Oh. Ooh, the remix. We need to do, maybe for season three, we'll, we'll eat it up on some remix type. Hmm. I don't know. They might be mad at us if we change that theme song. It's kind of, it's kind of, it's kind of iconic. What if we did like an Afro version? I will be riding with me with no keys. I get missed it. I missed that. No. Anyway, it's been so fun <laughs> doing the season with you, T. And shout out to Walmart. You. I love yeah. you too, T. Shout out to Walmart. Shout for out to Walmart. Us and believing in us. Yes. And believing in what we do and this brand and this mm -hmm. show. Mm -hmm. For them to go, you know what? We want to sign on to that. We think that you represent two people who are black and unlimited in everything that they do. And we appreciate that. And thank you for watching mm. every single episode and giving us ideas for next season. They already got us doing some crazy stuff for next time. Pump your brakes. We got to catch our <sighs> breath. I have never eaten a macadamia nut by choice. <laughs> I've always eaten something desserty and been, is there medacinamia nuts in here? <laughs> Brain fart because I've never eaten macadamia nuts. I know. So I don't know how to pronounce them well. Tea and Coco is sponsored by Walmart Black and Unlimited. For who you are and who you want to be, Walmart is here.